Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews. In this video, I will show you guys how you can restore your jailbroken iOS 10 device, of course, without updating and without having to lose a jailbreak. So you will restore to factory settings. Everything will be erased from your device, but you will be still on the same iOS version and you will be able to go ahead and again jailbreak your device. So you will have a fresh device and still will be able to jailbreak it. So the first thing you will need to do is open Cydia and from here you will need to add two repos. Add this repo right here which you will find in the description as well as this other repo right here which also will be found in the description. Then after you have done this what you need to do is go to this repo to the Coolstar repo and go to system right here and you need to install stashing for iOS 9.2 10.2. So you click on this, click install and then click confirm right here and now just wait for this to finish and it will ask you to reboot your device after it finishes so let's just wait here any second it should be done and then i will reboot my device and we'll come back and continue the process So as you can see right now it just asked me to go back to Cydia, didn't ask me to reboot my device so that's even better. So let's just return to Cydia so probably it will ask you to reboot your device and if you reboot your device you just come back to your device and you run the YALU app so, so you re jailbreak and then come back to Cydia and continue the process from here. So the next step is going to the jailbreak hub repo and here is where you have to reset your device. So you go to system. And here we'll have OS Restore X. So click on it. So just notice the second you tap install right here, it will start the process and you cannot go back from here. So it won't install anything on your device. It will start the process right here on Cydia. So after this, you will have to go and erase all data and content from your device. You don't have any other solution. You will have to go there and finish that process. You don't need to respring or reboot your device or anything just install this and go and delete all data so let's just try it so click install here click confirm so the second you click confirm here you're starting the process so you can see right now it will give you here 10 seconds if you regret this you just go ahead and close Cydia and it won't do anything but from here it starts the process and as you can see now it will start erasing so it will practically move all the jailbreak files to another spot which allows you to use the delete all data and content from your device from the settings of your device so this is basically what it does it allows you to use the delete all data and content which on jailbroken devices you know it's not a certain it's not such a good idea to do but with this tweak as you can see now it will crash Cydia with this tweak installed with this process it allows you to use that feature on your jailbroken device so now you go to settings and go to general and scroll down here to reset and from here you will be able to erase all data and content so just click here click once more and now it will start the process and after this finish you will have a fresh device everything will be deleted but you will be still on the same iOS version which means that you can still jailbreak so let's just wait for this process to finish right here and I will come back once the device is booted up so as you can see guys right here the process has been finished and my device has been restored but it's still on iOS 10.2 which means that I can still go ahead and jailbreak my device with a fresh start so everything will be wiped from the device so you can see here it's asking me for a sim in order to activate my device so let me just go through this setup and i will come back and show you guys the device has been cleared and there's nothing on it and i'm still on ios 10.2 so as you can see right here guys everything has been done successfully and I have restored my device you can see here it's still on iOS 10.2 which means that I can still install the YALU app and jailbreak my device and I have a fresh device here restored using this pretty cool process. 
So if you want to perform this process, make sure you follow these exact steps and you will find all the links that you need in the description of this video. So that's it. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Also, go ahead and follow me on my social media. You will find all the links in the description of the video.